almost 3,000 kilometers of Sweden's main road network consist of 13-meter roads. Nearly 100 motorists are killed every year on these roads. Some 60% of these accidents are head-on collisions. The possibility of making these roads safer by converting them into motorways is limited, since it would cost almost 100 billion Swedish krona to do so. Therefore, the Swedish National Road Administration has together with the Swedish Road and Transport Research Institute analyzed other, less expensive ways of increasing road safety on existing 13-meter roads. The method considered to be most effective is to build a three-lane road with alternating two and one lanes in each direction, where the lanes are separated by a central barrier in order to prevent head-on collisions. The first road to be equipped with the system was European Highway E4 between Djävle and Axmaltavla, a 32-kilometer long arterial road that was open for traffic in 1987. A total of 21 people were killed in head-on collisions on this stretch of road between 1987 and 1998. It has been concluded that the serious consequences of two-thirds of these accidents could have been prevented by a central barrier. In 1998, the stretch of road in question was provided with a central barrier of the wire rope type. The wire rope barrier selected is called Safence and is a Blue Systems product. If there is a breakdown, puncture or a serious accident on a 2 plus 1 road, there is a risk of the central barrier impairing the access of rescue services. Dismantling a wire rope barrier of the safe fence type is a very simple procedure. No tools are needed and the tension in the ropes does not need to be adjusted. Once the ropes have been lifted off a sufficient number of posts, the ropes are simply laid on the ground. The traffic can now be directed over the ropes and around the scene of the accident. Throughout the entire procedure, traffic can be directed around the scene of the accident. The steel rope barrier can now be reinstalled. No tools are needed and the tension in the ropes does not need to be adjusted. A safety barrier is usually erected in the final stages of highway construction, 
or on an existing highway within a closed off area. It is then important to minimize operational stoppages and to ensure that installation can be carried out quickly without any deterioration in quality. Repair of a wire rope fence always means disruption of traffic for the road user and a dangerous workplace for the road worker. Therefore, it is important that repair work on the fence can be done easily and quickly without any loss of quality. This is possible with the right technique and the right tools. In order to ensure the quality, function, length of life and standards of service for our products, we train service personnel concerned on each stretch of highway where our fence has been installed. This is part of our policy of following our products through all stages of manufacture and use. In order to maximize the life of the fence, we have selected materials and hot galvanizing standards in accordance with experience gained in Denmark and Sweden of very aggressive road environments, since salt is often used here. There is always a solution at hand for cordoning off obstacles or for connection to other types of safety barrier.